apps are hugely popular in the United States. It is projected that in 2024, there will be 35.4 million Americans on dating apps, an increase of 30.4 million in 2019, according to Statista. These apps are becoming household names, Tinder, Bumble, OkCupid, Grindr. They make it super easy to swipe through possible partners and set up dates. But there's an emerging problem with these apps. They aren't doing much to protect users from online predators. There are a variety of problems. Catfishing is common. This means there are also problems with sex trafficking and assault. In 2018, Congress decided to take action. Lawmakers passed H.R. 1865, the Stop Enabling Sex Traffickers Act, and Allow States and Victims to Fight Online Sex Trafficking Act, also known as FOSTA-SESTA. The bill states that it is illegal for a website to be knowingly assisting, supporting, or facilitating posts or advertisements of sexual nature. The bill was pushed by Ivanka Trump and co-sponsored by 27 Democratic and Republican senators. It was even backed by Bernie Sanders and Elizabeth Warren in their 2020 campaigns. The bill passed 97-2 in the Senate. FOSTA-SESTA caused Craigslist to remove their personal section, with the website stating, any tool or service can be misused. We can't take such risk without jeopardizing all our other services. FOSTA-SESTA makes it illegal to knowingly support sex trafficking online. Sounds like a worthy cause, right? Have you noticed that Craigslist removed its personals page? Have you posted an appropriate photo to Instagram to have it taken down? This is an effort to eliminate sex trafficking from the internet but it is arguably crossing a line into censorship. Fosta sesta is problematic for many other reasons. The bill silences marginalized groups and eliminates safe spaces for sex workers. This censorship also puts the victims of human trafficking in more danger. By deleting the digital footprint of someone in a human trafficking situation, it becomes harder to find that person. There is little to no evidence that the safeguards put into place by FOSTA SESTA make any difference in the activity of sex traffickers. Reaching a safer internet will not happen through big government censorship, but through listening to the requests of marginalized groups. It will be reached when internet users are supported by internet platforms instead of silencing them.